paralyzed below the chest for four years, but no longer confined to a wheelchair. This extraordinary video taken by scientists shows Rob Summers standing under his own control using muscles he'd been unable to move since breaking his back in a hit and run accident. Back on. In what they describe as a breakthrough, the researchers implanted electrodes next to his spinal cord and reactivated nerve circuits to allow him to voluntarily move his hips, knees, ankles and toes. Mr. Summers said the procedure had completely changed his life. I wasn't able to move a toe or anything for four years. And on the third day of turning the stimulator on, I was able to stand independently. Uh, not only did that boost my confidence and uh, continue to, to give me hope towards my ultimate goal of getting up and standing and walking, um, but it, it helped me out physically and emotionally as well. The American scientists explain in the Lancet Medical Journal how they implanted 16 electrodes below the break in Mr. Summers' spinal cord. Tiny pulses of electricity were fired down the nerve fibers. This activated nerve circuits, and in combination with balance signals returning along nerves from his legs, he was able to direct his muscles and joints to stand and step. We were able to get um, the legs to move in flexion extension patterns like walking within the very first week and that was very unexpected and we were able to get him to stand without any help at the legs so he was generating enough force to bear his body weight. Left toe up, left toe down. With the device turned off Mrs. Summers was unable to move. Left leg up, but with the implant stimulating his nerves, he could lift his leg. Three, two, one. Although scientists warn more research is needed, video of the experiments will give hope to thousands of people who were told they would never walk again. Thomas Moore, Sky News.